Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm teaching you guys how to download and install texture packs, resource packs, they're the exact same thing in Minecraft 1.14. Yes, Minecraft 1.14 literally came out like an hour ago and we're here doing a video for it showing you how to get resource packs. First and foremost though, we do have a message from our sponsor which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Get an awesome 24 hour DDoS protected Minecraft server running Minecraft 1.14, running any mod pack you want, running Minecraft plugins, anything you want to do with a Minecraft server, you can do it over on Apex Minecraft Hosting. We actually have Apex so much that we host our own server on them, play.breakdowncraft.com. So nevertheless, if you want an incredible 24-hour DDoS protected server, Apex is the place to go. Again, there's the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and jump right on into this. The first thing that you're going to need in order to install a resource pack is, well, to download a resource pack. Now, luckily for you, we do have in the description down below, the second link down below, a list of 15 resource packs for Minecraft here, right? So the these are all updated. Actually, these aren't all updated. We're updating them right after this video to 114. And uh, so you know that when you come here, every single resource pack on this list is going to be 114 native and be rocking and rolling, ready for you to install. However, 114 came out an hour ago. So I have to use this one, which is actually ran on the beta of 114. It will work on the official release, though. And it's called Default. 3D, and uh, it's actually a really interesting 3D texture bag. You'll actually see it here in a second when it switches this cobblestone block. Look at that. There's that, and it's like all 3D, and this cobblestone block is like all 3D too. So pretty cool. We'll add this to our list of the top 15 texture packs, so you'll be able to find the link there if you want it. But once you're here, you want to just go ahead and download the file, and uh, that's how you can find resource packs. Basically, we've got a list of 15 awesome ones here for Minecraft 1.14, and then we're going to be installing this one in this video. Now, when you download it, it'll be in the bottom left of your screen. You may need to keep the file, but most likely you won't, so it'll just automatically download. Now, if I go ahead and minimize our browser, this is on my desktop. If it's not on your desktop, no worries. Click the little Windows icon. It's in the top left for me, but it's in the bottom left of your screen, that little Windows icon on the bottom left. Click on that. Type in downloads right like so, and you'll have a downloads folder here. You'll find the texture pack you downloaded in your downloads folder. Drag it to your desktop just for ease of use. Nevertheless, once it's on your desktop, we actually need to open up Minecraft. So I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. We're going to open up Minecraft, and we're just going to launch right on into it. This is the first time I've actually opened 1.14. As you can see, latest release, 1.14 there. Click on that and click play. And this is the perfect time for me to tell you about our server, play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. We have native 1.14 survival. Yes, you heard that right, native 1.14 survival server. Come play with us, play.breakdowncraft.com breakdowncraft.com. It's got quests. It's got jobs. It is absolutely incredible and you will absolutely love it. So again, come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com. We've even got Skyblock over there. That is just insane. Always over a hundred players online on the server. So come play with us. Again, play.breakdowncraft.com. Nevertheless, I will go ahead and jump cut to the Minecraft main menu. And once we're there, we'll be ready to install the resource pack. So here we go. First launch of 1.14. I'm actually really excited for this. The new loading bar, nice touch. I thought that was coming in 1.13, but they, they didn't add it in 1.13. So it's actually just uh, kind of loading in there. And there we go. Minecraft Village and Pillage Update. I love that. So now to install resource pack. You want to go to this options button from our main menu here, and then you want to click on resource packs. So the first thing I notice is actually 113.2 resource packs are fully working. So these are all 113.2 resource packs, and as you can see, I can move them over and use them all. But to install a new resource pack, go ahead and click on this open resource pack folder down here in the bottom left. See that? Click on that and it will open up a resource pack folder. Then just take the resource pack you download, in our case it is default 3D, and drag that into the resource packs folder. Now if we come back over here, click done. It's gonna go ahead kind of reload stuff, right like so, and then we can go back into the resource packs folder and there is default 3D. Go ahead and click that over, click play, and it will go ahead reload yet again. It's kind of an interesting feature that they've added in this reload button. That is new, very cool. But nevertheless, once it gets done reloading, we will see that the textures have applied if we jump in game. Wow, it actually changed the background back to 113, even though it's 114, because this texture pack has like added that in. So nevertheless, let's go ahead and just jump into, I'll jump into this world right here. Oh, this is the first time I'm loading this on 114, isn't it? We'll back it up and load it up. I will see you after a uh, quick loading the game. So I don't know what it's doing right now, but this is actually really cool. I don't know if this is like it's loading in or like converting the world. I, I don't, I don't know what's happening here, but that is awesome. Way to go, Mojang. I like all this like status bars and it's showing you what is going on. I, I can really get behind that. So way to go, Mojang. And, uh, 
cool little load up there. All right, it's at 38 percent. I will see you once it's at 100 percent. There we go. We are now at 100 percent and joining into the world for the first time in Minecraft 1.14. Get a little lagging going there. But as you can see, that cobblestone texture is definitely the same cobblestone texture that we had in the preview of the texture pack. We've also got 3D on the fences. This is actually a pretty cool pack here. All sorts of different 3D options here that you can see. Are cows affected? I think cows are affected a little bit. I don't think cows normally have like the ears that stick up there. Fences, even ladders. Now, like, look at that. They actually stick out past the block. That is actually a really, really cool setup. And uh, I can actually get behind this texture pack. That's, that's pretty cool. We've also got furnaces. Look at that. You can actually see inside of the furnaces. I wonder if you put something in the furnace if it shows up. Um, I don't have anything I can put in a furnace, I don't think. No, I, I, I don't. But, but anyway. Oh, maybe, maybe that'll show up. No, okay. We can't get that lucky. But nevertheless, it's still a very, very cool texture pack. And even look at that. The crafting table is cool there. If you do have any questions about getting a resource pack in Minecraft 1.13.2, please let us know in the comment section down below. We try our best to answer every single comment we get. Also, be sure to come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse, running Minecraft 1.14. Come play with us. Play it on breakdowncraft.com. Anyway, my name is Nick. Look at that cool texture. This has been the breakdown, and I am out. Peace.